Just doing the Prada show, all the girls were so nice, save for like one or two, save for one or two. Because <laughs> I was like, got there and not realize how famous these girls were. Yeah. Because I was new to the industry, so I was like, hi, my name is Allison. Like an idiot, right? That's okay. I think that's a better way to go. I think it's better to go um, in not knowing who anyone yeah, is. Yeah, but it still felt awkward later. And I'm like, oh, right, she's like number four on the top model list. Great, awesome. <laughs> I just embarrassed myself. But they were always like, oh, hi, like, no, like, my name's Lindsay, like, what's your name? And they were always, like, so nice, so yeah. sweet. So when I did Toronto Fashion Week, I was expecting that. And the thing is, the product show was, like, sitting with each other, chatting with each other, meeting everyone. They're yeah. like, oh, I've met you, but I've seen you do this work. Congrats. Like, yeah. hey, it was like a, it was like a slumber party. Everyone was so nice yeah. and, like, talking to each other. And then when I got to Toronto, everyone was sitting on their own, way separate from each other, sitting there, like, on their iPhones, reading magazines, and then... My favorite part, my favorite part of that day, was a girl came up and sat next to me and she was like, hi, what's your name? And I was like, Madison. She's like, hi, I'm blah blah. Um, have you done Toronto Fashion Week before? And I hadn't, so I was like, no, I haven't yet. And I had just come back from Paris, or Paris Day Mew Mew. Mm -hmm. And she was like, well, I have. Um, all the designers here love me. I work for this and this company every single year. Don't worry, are you a little nervous? I get nervous, I used to get nervous. And like, I do it, the, like, ah, oh. and she was just going on and on and like, being like, if you need some tips, just let me know. And I was like, just sitting there, just like, oh my gosh, you're a little crazy. <laughs> she was under the impression it was my first time. Yeah. Why are you doing this to me? You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Why would you do that to someone else? Yeah. At first I thought that maybe girls on the bottom, it's all in huge quotation marks. Yeah. It's not the bottom, it's a starting place. You know what I mean? Yeah. I don't think it's because girls who are lower are necessarily more negative and girls who are get just get more positive the higher up they go I think that a lot of girls who are at the top are there because of their attitudes someone at the boot camp said something that has really stuck with me they were like you know what a model can be look amazing and be amazing and she will get hired she'll get hired once or twice maybe by the same like by the same companies but that's about it because at the end of the day nobody wants to actually pay an asshole and that has really stuck with me if you're amazing at what you do, that's great. You probably get hired once or twice. But if you're a dick, no one's gonna actually wanna pay you. It would just feel strange paying someone you hated that much.